everyone and welcome to DMP Online tutorial on setting up DMP Online. In the previous video, we covered how to create theme guidance that can be applied across various templates. In the short video, I'll explain how to create question-specific guidance. If you create your own template, you can add guidance to accompany each question as you create the template. So here I'll go into my existing DMP Online tutorial template. I click here and I have decided to add a question specific guidance to my uh, questions around the data collection. So I already have a question here. I click here on edit and now I'll insert the guidance into the guidance box here. So I added my guidance and I hit save. And now I have successfully added guidance to my question. Don't forget that when you add a guidance, um, you will have to republish your template. So I go back to my template and I will click on publish changes. And now the guidance will appear. So let me just check. I go back to the template I go to my data collection question and now I can see I added my guidance. Guidance can be also provided for specific founder questions. This can be useful when the guidance will only be relevant in um, the context of one of the questions. So I'll go back to the templates and I have decided to customize ESRC template and I will be adding a guidance to backup and security of the data um, because, for example, your institution has some specific policies around this that is not covered in the ESRC template. Now I have added my guidance. Again, I hit save. And I'll go back to my template to see edit guidance so it says unpublished I say publish and I'll just double check whether my guidance appears here now so I go back to backup and security of the data yeah and I can see my guidance is saved with adding question specific guidance don't forget that every single time the founder template changes you will have to add your guidance manually. There is the benefit of creating the theme guidance, which can be applied across different templates uh, when the template, the template changes. The question specific guidance is linked to the template you're applying it to. So again, if the founder template changes, you'll have to manually reinsert your guidance. I hope you have enjoyed this video and do not forget that if there is anything specific you wish us to explain, please get in touch with us at dmponline at dcc.ac.uk, subscribe to our monthly newsletter and follow us uh, on Twitter, Facebook and LinkedIn to keep up to date with our most recent work. The links are below this video. Goodbye.